You guys make me very world. mad. This I told you guys to spam W, but only a handful of people spam W. You guys make me cry. This is why I cry at night, chat. Absolutely. Dante transitioning to the tank role Ooh. had an impact immediately. I know if I so many people battle, wondered, Kiri, you know, I think like Kiri's better. Why he was sort of moved off the roster that he started playing tank on. Uh, there was a lot of Kiri over Bat. He was a, he was a, a, yeah. a standout. I think Suzy's just team. too good. And Cass oh, over Sojourn. Luminosity here. You see Squid having to cover quite a few angles in Fisher. Oh shit, so okay. Out of line of sight. Squid cannot keep him topped up. And that's looking dangerous. Timeless have already found their in. Rocket cracks this one right open. Now more than happy to duel with King because there's a player advantage that's starting to exert itself over the balance of power. Dante forced back here. Body block for a time that fortify used oh, to try and get back through the choke. And Rocket is Arisa waiting is for so open arms on the other side. Are they nothing Arisa actually? So about they should if they're not. Is the fact that you have CJ playing the Kiriko versus Squid on the Baptiste. Both of those heroes, of course, can provide a ton of healing output. But when we take a look at the Kiriko and what they're able to provide in terms of that utility, that Suzu is just undeniably so strong. Especially when you look at the pulse bombs being traded on. Both yeah, I think I think Sojourn just beats the cast, yeah, man. Can out oh ultimate. shit, never mind, he's uh, cooking. Holy shit. Yeah, it feels it very much feels like it is a big difference maker. It beats it. Though down, no Susu available for the time being as King was able to stick to that Kiriko. Oh no. Envision. Oh. Job being done by the rest of his team, and he'll get involved by removing the tracer. And that's one way you can really bring yourself back into the fight is if you just take out that thorn. Oh, that my team played timeless. Yeah, that that, that hurt. Healing as well as that utility in the Suzu, and it's oh, way yeah. easier for you. Uh, how did you do? Did you guys? Kind of did you guys take a map? Or? Oh no, we, we didn't. So, we got rolled. But you got rolled. We we did have a very competitive like as well one map on God. <laughs> okay, that's sick. In this fight, but let's listen in to see how luminosity. You got three rounds or just two? Uh, uh, I think it was the first to two, right? Oh, was it the first to three? It would be first. First to two, right? Yeah, they no, they they rolled us. We played Hollywood and we played Koth. Oh, okay. But oh no, on Koth we only went two rounds. We didn't go all three. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, but our uh. Our Hollywood game was really funny because we, we we knew we were not uh, what do you call it? We knew we were losing, but like we we had a three two one go, and then we turned it to two one go, and then we thought that was still too long. Then we turned it to one go, and then we just then we just started making our comms go. Oh my God. It was it was fun. Yo, JK, how are you? Five this I like it. Improvement. Ass and W. Mid match out of station. Dead eye here for vision. Pushing timeless away for now. Oh, speed him. And it's just a small opening. It doesn't even allow for a full cap. Timeless still maintain control of the point. Ooh. Oh, I see him. got blown the fuck up. With the sound barrier on top from opener. Oh, my oh God, shit. Rip Squid's head off his shoulders. At least the app matrix plus vision shots able to come what in a and beast. secure a trade. Terra Surge holding King and Vision in place there. Great turnaround. And that was the ult that was God, called right. Luminosity. Okay. They have Sound Barrier, they also have Arisa ult. I see able to run Dante down here and put Timeless in a position to take the round here. Still a very competitive round though coming up from Luminosity. I think something that they did struggle with is just making sure that they were able to keep pace with things that Timeless were bringing to the table. Whether it was just making sure they had the right healing output or being able to actually chunk down those low health targets and actually take them out. Luminosity may just need like a second to we're bringing to the table, whether it was just making sure they had the right healing output or being able to actually chunk down those low health targets and actually take them out. Luminosity may just need like a second to really figure out the pace of how they need to match into a team like Timeless. But ooh, they're warmed. They should be warmed up. No, Uber, they got a they got a whole collegiate match under their belt right now. Everybody's playing collegiate today. <laughs> yeah, get, getting those games out of the way is definitely important. But I feel like this is probably. A different beast entirely. Timeless are locked in right now. And that first round, while competitive at some points, ultimately looked very, very solid from them. I think Chopper coming in from the top rope. Uh, you know, with some key overclocks there, really swung things in Timeless's favor. Well, of course, to have the Orisa Ah, still. shit, chat. Oh, oh shit. Dunk. Sneaky peeky like here. Maybe hoping What's to get up? someone overextended. Maybe they need to rotate space, quicker. So give her a Sheesh. energy javelin and follow up, but. Luminosity yeah, CJ dies. Wow. Room. 
It looked like they wanted to be a little late. Yeah, they rotated, but CJ was just a little slow. Big, a big hit now needs to make himself scarce as King with three runs over the top of Timeless. And that's the kind of star you're looking for here. Add another one to that tally. King is accounted for four of five eliminations of Timeless. Tracer already heating up. A really great wraparound there from Luminosity as well. While we ended up seeing Rocket try to take an off angle from Timeless, the rest of Luminosity were just walking into that Timeless front line. It brought so much space for King to be able to just grab those picks. And a nice disengage here as well here from Luminosity as they try to play around this corner. I see looking for a way in here. Or at least a way to create some space to send Rocket on a flank. Rocket playing the point right now from the left hand side. Javelin has been used by Dante here, but he's taken a fair bit of damage. The Ant Matrix though is going to allow Luminosity to force Timeless back. They are wrapped around the corner, and King isn't done. He dives deep and plucks Rocket out, and once more, the Tracer gives that player advantage to Luminosity. Now this is what we wow, I'm actually see. really surprised Luminosity is taking the initiative here. It was a call that you heard of yeah, they're using the ropes like super well, but they have uh, Thomas have rush now, so this should be a win. Unless they high noon it, and they they fucking lamp the high noon too. I get it. There we go. And they save three else too. So I see can plunge into the heart of Luminosity. Timeless need to get in charge of the point real quick. That'll do it. Sound barrier also ex expended. I mean, that's a good fight. It's not bad, actually, Blue Blumose. They still have beat. So they can beat Overclock and then just try and save amp speed for a recent Terra Surge. And then... There's always going to be a two ults. Two ults for three, though. That gives so much yeah, but B is just so good. To the rest of the timeless squad, and on top of that, too, with the they're definitely going to try and beat Overclock, I think. You're just going to be a little bit too. It's actually really cool to see a college team actually playing in here. Yeah, Luminosity is Maryville. Yes, ultimates, but ultimately they gave up a point really quickly, so they can come in here with this Terra Surge. Yeah, collegiate in America is amazing, actually. It's one thing we don't have in UK, like collegiate stuff. Great layering of that utility here by Luminosity. This is a very comfortable fight win for them. After the fact, or at least the team's most powerful. It's not just like the mobility, but it's also survivability because Orisa's cooldowns get refreshed so much quicker. Two of her cooldowns, of course, are defensive, so it's really hard to like fight on even footing when she's like fortifying. You know, twice as often, and having so much ability to break damage up with javelin spin. Yeah, and she also just like shoots. Uh, does a ton of damage. Like uh, Arissa's damage output is nothing to be underestimated. But it's time here to see what Chopper can do with this overclock. Chopper takes note of King, aggressively blinking into his field of view. Holy shit! How do you not get that kill? That overclock. We no. might see Chopper try and take some more space to make use of it. He's trying. Javelin spin's gonna be a problem though. Mag grenade dropped at his feet, but is out of catch vision on the way down. Beautiful work. Another big hit here, and immortality field is drawn out. Chopper walks into it though, and with that extra durability, Luminosity can hold that. Wow, down. Luminosity playing this so well. No Holy shit! No out of this fight, and Icy is gonna try and solve but this round so is over. Luminosity. Pulse bomb accounts for much of the Arissa's health, and the Katsune rush at least gets Icy out, but he still needs to contest to some degree. And CJ is zoned away; he can't heal. Luminosity even up Samoa. Quite a convincing second round. Looked really clean from them. Again, going back to just being able to play on top Ooh, of each other. Make one, sure that one. Everybody is going to be able to take advantage of the extra burst healing coming out from the Baptiste. Or even That's just being able Good to showing from LG so far. I'm going to be honest with you. I thought Timeless was going to clear this. But I want my Luminosity to win. Oh, hell yeah. The L yeah, I mean, LG spot, yeah. But does that oh, uh, like LG? That last round was so sick. I thought they were going to beat the Overclock, but Chopper never ripped it. It was so weird. They with Terra Surge first, I guess, to try and force OC, but Chopper just never ripped the ult, and then they were fine to just win the fight. That was nice. And then they try and retake with Overclock, which Chopper as well. Uh, a little bit more than Volcano, as it can be hard to find value outside of those disrupt the shot niche plays. So we'll see it play out here. We have a switch over towards Ash for Vision, so they, they themselves don't feel particularly comfortable with Cassidy's effective range on a map like this. They definitely fancy punishing the grouping up of Timeless with some of these dynamites. Exhibit A. Oh, the Ash. Vision will be thrown back here for a time, but pretty unbothered by the original. Yeah, I don't know if I like the Ash, but. Oh, if he hits shots like that, okay, I take back. If he hits shots like that, you can play yeah. I don't know, man. I think Sojourn's still a better better pick. He's still better, yeah, 100%. Bob is really... I, I think Bob's, like, sneaky OP on this point, actually. 
I mean, that was great interference being run Ooh, by nice Juby there. Chopper couldn't close the gap. They got interrupted halfway through the power slide and got popped up just so Vision could pick them off. King also picking up from where he left off in the last round. Great little three-piece from King Illuminosity once more firmly in the driver's seat. You get a chance to play a little bit more far forward, and something about Luminosity's comp that's just so nice is that Ash is going to be providing some really consistent damage output. Instead of having to charge up this big railgun shot and potentially whiffing it onto a head, uh, you get a chance to just kind of keep putting out these. Hello, chat. I'm trying to pick a. So I'm trying to make something. Now. Hail, though. Push your method eight months. Go. Ground it's only. Tier three for 43, my friend. I appreciate it. Reasonable choice, I suppose. But Chopper's still probing, looking for an opening. Can't stand still for too long, lest he have his head taken clean off by Vision. Oh, he's going to pull us that Arisa. Yep. This is going to force Timeless into more defensive positions. Fortify on IC, but eventually will be brought down after the Pulse Bomb connects. CJ, he got hammered there by Vision. Beautiful headshot, and this Ash is kind of taken over the round alongside King's Tracer. I see he got so isolated, and I think that's something else that the Dynamite does a really great job of, is it forces you to have to back away, and sometimes into a disadvantageous position, like below point where you are out of the sight line, or even just out of the way of getting some help there from your support. So, we're all like, just like that, Mitch, we're kind of looking at a last fight territory here for Luminosity of Timeless, continue to take their time to get back into this, but they do have the rush, which is a great engagement tool here. Yeah, but they're gonna run into a, a, a Risa roll, a bomb potentially to pop them up here. Timeless had never really had a distinct advantage in Ultra Economy. That's what they needed to see. Chopper finds vision. Finally, the Sojourn wins out against the Ash in the long range duel. This will allow Timeless to immediately transition over to the point, and only at the cost of a Katsune Rush. So that is a very cost-efficient fight win. It's a super valuable ultimate, though, for Timeless. Even if it's not going to be just there as an engagement tool, it is a way for them to be able to actually get a chance to... Sorry, I was creating a new Instagram charge. account so I could, like, so you've got the do you've got stuff, the stuff with it. Because so I keep... Oh, the, the, whole, the current Instagram thing that I have is, like, personal pictures. I'm creating an Instagram account for, like, like TikTok stuff. Dude, what a fucking ult I down there. Must be able to stay alive for now. There's the Suzu. Dante going to be interrupting IC whenever possible, and that terror surge comes down. Open won't have a chance to get away. He was the intended target there. Dante forcing IC back. A pulse bomb will chomp through that health. And again, fortify it. Won't make a difference. Luminosity. Oh, back in shit. LG. Rock is dead too. Increase a bit more of that percentage. Open as one HP. Timeless, less of a chance. They didn't touch. Even. Ooh. Look at Rocky getting chunked before able to touch the point. No for the okay. Oh shit, yeah, you're a few seconds. <laughs> yeah, I was like, I was, uh, oh, sorry. No, you're, you're good, you're good. They. Oh shit, bro. I thought Timeless was going to clear this, but good shit. What do you mean I can't follow? Chat. I'll, 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 listen. If you guys really wanted to follow it, it's on my main channel as well. If you really wanted to follow my new IG, I just made it. It's, it's going to be my, it's going to be like my TikTok, but for Instagram. I refuse to follow. How about you fucking follow these? Okay, right, my bad. I was making something. I, I'm, I'm here now. No, you're vibing, bro. I'm just chilling. I love listening to the comms. We used to do a lot of comms stuff actually back in Overwatch League. Yeah, I'm... I wish they did more. Uh, Overwatch League used to have that like uh, all access pass. You could watch anyone you want, and it should have been. It's. I can't believe they took it away. Well. It, they took it away because we transitioned to YouTube. Ah, uh, media rights deal. Andy for 40 months. I appreciate my friend. It kind of sucked oh. in, in a way because, yeah, the, the all access pass was fucking awesome. It was one of my favorite parts, but it cost a lot to maintain. And as much as it was cool, like, the cost it uh, required to maintain, I don't think outweighed the cost of, like, the program itself. Really? Yeah, because you're running, like, doesn't get you very far away. however many separate streams so what is it like 12 separate streams at the same time and like 
tech behind that on Twitch's side as well. Like, it costs a lot of money. It's not as simple as like, oh, we'll just stream 12 pods like that. There's like a lot of stuff in there. Oh, okay, makes sense. Yeah, but it does suck bad, by the way. Like, that shit was so fucking gas. Yeah, see whoever you wanted. Yeah. Oh, that pulse. Oh. Dude, nano break. <laughs> I mean, I see, I see how it costs so much money, but I remember Apex does something similar. That's 60 people. Um. So. Apex, oh, can it do the? Can you switch it on the the main stream? Can you switch to individual POV? Yeah, I think. Um, I remember watching Seagull's ALGS stream, and you could watch anyone you want. Dang. And then like. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I don't know. That's uh, I, I can't say that's And if you are moving it, you are in danger. That Lucio was so That's fucking cool that Apex do that. You oh, need that in oh, a game. Oh, Apex only has uh, one man per team, so I'm pretty sure it was like the main captain, I guess. But you can listen to their comms and shit. Yo, that's fucking awesome. That kind of stuff's so sick, actually. For yeah, you especially, listen to their comms. Especially for Apex, because Apex is such a hard game to spectate. Yeah, I remember watching Seagull and he would have three streamers uh, channels up, three streamers POVs up, and you could listen to all the comms as well. And I remember uh, watching, it, I think it was like Hal, and Hal was like, I need a gun, I need a gun, and someone's like, there's a gun over here, and he's like, ping it, you dumb fuck, and it was just like the funniest comms. <laughs> Dude, Hal is so toxic in game, it's so fucking funny. He bullies reps and shit. Yeah, bro. He was just, I remember it. I was like, I, there's a, I need a gun. I need a gun. I'm running out of ammo. There's a gun over here. He's like, I don't know where here is. Dumbass fucking ping it. It was just the comms at the given time were just so funny. And on land, too. Oh, it's classic. Uh, Suzu smile. Suzu moment. Yeah, dude. The Suzus today from Slay. Holy shit. They were ridiculous. Every pulse bomb. Those dives high and low ground, making sure he gets all of his healing from Luke himself. Pulse here for Rocket. Tough to find them here. Rocket can only really take this route in, and it's a little bit treacherous. But nice little pressure coming oh. from Rocket. That means Rocket Holy has shit. his head turning away from Oh, yeah, Rocket is disgusting. Is exactly he is just different. Now vision being taken out of the fight, it's all but done. He's a Come superstar in the making. Dante at Primal for sure. just doesn't get it done. I wonder if we do see a bit of a composition. I, I just want to see if his, if his other like, characters are as good though. Like, if he has a tracer one trick, that's gonna be tough. Style of dive play, but now you're wasn't he always? Wasn't he originally a tracer OTP, right? And then yeah. Less high to play now he's because I remember speaking to Jake about it, and he said he was always OTP, dive, but he so close to he's the pretty good at other characters. But honestly. Tracer's oh, probably the one. So Tracer and Lucio are probably the two characters that you can get away with like half one tricking for the most part, because of how strong the character is. But maybe if Tracer gets nerfed, like he's gonna need to learn something else. Or they just play Chopper and Sonjin. CJ Swift stepping away, but King preempts it. Knew the Tracer would head in that direction. I the Kiriko rather. And King uh, CJ would not be allowed to escape. All right. Well, the dive is working for now, and even still, Dante's able to get a bit more high ground presence. See if he can get a bit more scouting in. By the time the timers are able to get back out of spawn, so Andre, going over to the Widowmaker really quickly just to see if you can kind of force Luminosity back away from those spawn doors, but. You still gotta be so careful, and I think Luminosity are playing with fire a little bit as they stay within Sonjin's sight lines. Yeah, they'll probably want to hug that corner if they can. Dante sees the soldier coming and heads back to the corner as well. Pulse here for King, so wants to see that the power slide drawn out of the Sojourn before he goes in. That would be the optimal target to find with that ultimate. In comes the dive, everyone gets split up there. Suzu gets used early, but it looks to think so there's an opening here. Oh my by God. The pulse. Dante also has that use nano to keep Dante alive. From that in the next Holy. couple of moments, and he does so with a primal rage. Instantly, half his health bar vaporizes. Now being forced to play more defensively, but lacking the range option the Tesla cannon gives you, he'll be brought down by an even better range option in Sonjin. Oh my goodness, this card is getting so close to the finish line. Sonjin is continuing to just take some names here. And he just isn't quite nearly enough to push Timeless back. Yeah, Timeless looking much more comfortable on this map. 
Yeah, Timeless is kind of cooking here. To finish this whole map is kind of insane. Yeah, I'm not sure they... Oh, dude, if they could team wipe and get over a minute, that'd be nuts. Oh, okay, nice map. They are cooking. Oh, they're cooking now. Sonjun. Get his ass. Sonjun. Oh, using a whole rail on a tracer though. Yeah, it's kind of rough. They have rally too. They should be able to survive this. There's no shot you fight against that rally. Sonja doesn't overextend either. Timeless realize they've got to back away with the rally being used. Rally's just going to give too much over health right now for Timeless. They just want to go rush. Rush, pulse, pulse the brig. He sees brig. He's just getting the damage off the monkey. There we go. Ooh. 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 There we go. Yeah, his tracer is insane, man. It's nasty. Gets the fight taken up close and can't deal with it. Really good push there from Timeless. They're gonna finish with 27 seconds left in the clock as well. So. You think LG gets this? Time push that Luminosity was was aiming for by the time that they had broken. If Rocket keeps if Rocket keeps playing like this, I don't know. I feel like. I don't know. Dante was like. Luminosity is gonna be. Dante was kind of trolling a little bit on the Winston Sally. It's really hard for him to get anything done, I think, especially with um, the Soldier and the Tracer just perm like on you. Because he used, they had to, he was in, he had to get Nano, he jumped out, hit Primal, and he was still like under a quarter of HP. Like he was getting fucked. This is also probably the, the best roster look. I think their timers kind of have right now, right? I think you can see the instant impact that Riker and Sunjun have added. Uh, it, such confidence with these Winston dives. Sanjun able to manufacture picks. Oh, you like the music chat? Just really wouldn't be evident. Switching over to the castle, <laughs> <still, though>, so <laughs> despite that <laughs> lack of mobility and sort of the danger of playing within the radius of a dive com, both teams have opted for the cast here, perhaps as well to make it harder for that tracer to slip in with their mag grenade. I think you always have to look at the mag grenade as just a really nice counter to the tracer, but I think as well, you also just look at the Cassidy having so much zoning potential with something like the Deadeye on these long straightaways. Oh, you know what I could do next game? Uh, you know what I should have done this game, chat? I should have made popcorn. That central pillar, but Damn. As soon as you head into the street space, oh, it doesn't matter anyways. I'm going to eat dinner really soon, I guess. Good about the sight lines that that Cassidy has. Out of the gates. Timeless finishing the map with about 30 seconds to spare. Not too shabby. Was a little bit slow going towards the end there, but that's to be expected. Yo, Michelle Ma, so appreciate your for 14 months, my friend. Thank Here's you, thank you. Off, go off somewhere, but wasn't quite sure where it was. We are charged up. No real targets presenting themselves right now. Vision, the Dante Winstone. Eh? To be on the ground, but it'll dissuade any dive for the time being. Mag grenade found Dante. But he's just getting no intention of moving in that moment. In. Against, against the Arista too, that's so rough. Dealing with the Arista here, maybe even wishing they came out of Swan on the Cassidy to fight this. Raika almost having that armor chewed through. We'll try and interact with oh, Dante that's from the low pick. ground. There it is. Vision finally gets involved. There's inevitability about a sojourn on the high ground getting charged up. And opener is the prize. Damn, Vision. Maybe another follow up there too on Asuncion. So time must have to go back to spine. What now. is Sojourn's spiny circle thing called again? Uh, yeah, disruptor shot. Raika here, maybe just stalling this out a little bit longer. That is a very convincing Night, that was, that's a huge yeah, first point like win. Oh yeah, Vision rolled actually. He just sniped really opener and then sniped the another guy. Like can. They had the fight taken to them. They can't well. do anything about Vision once he gets the high ground. They just let him play there. That, but if you're gonna take out the Lucio as well, you remove so much of your ability to kite away from that dive damage, and Luminosity are able to take full control of a situation like that. Now, though, opening up these castle gates, Timeless, we're able to beat Luminosity the punch to set up on this high ground. But Wait, don't you have that spray as well? So much more playground uh, the official Overwatch League spray? Yes. Yeah, yeah, I've got all those, yeah. Uh, There's like nice. three of them, I think. Free damage down there for anybody. Luminosity wants to come <laughs> Why? Because <laughs> I don't, Yeah, bro. I'm a player, bro. I'm a player. Sort of zoned off by Dante going upstairs. You should have played the Overwatch League, bro. You should have made it. Bro! Yo, I, I need it. You have contacts, man. Let me get it. <laughs> no, I can't give you one of those. What the fuck? Hell, I can't uh, let them give you that. Come on, man. <laughs> Can't really touch the cart right now when the maybe if you ma maybe if they uh make an OWCS one, you make it to a major, maybe they can do it. Oh, that would look good. Have to make it, I know there's a there apparently there's a Hanzo skin if you go to Dream, uh, Dreamhack Dallas. Yeah, I'm not sure how you get it, but yeah, the Dallas 
home, uh, the major skin? Yeah, it looks fucking sick, actually. I'm so happy they're doing that stuff. Yeah. I'm hoping it's, like, some sort of crowdfunding incentive, and if not, like, crowdfunding incentive in the future, I think that's such a good way to help the eSport. I, I thought they were doing something crowdfunded. Yeah, I, I don't know how they're doing the Hanzo skin, to be honest. Uh, I hadn't fried into it because they did that for World Cup, and if they just keep continuing to do that, yeah, I like the I like the World Cup one, but wasn't it like twenty five percent of the profits went to like the crowd, like or something ridiculous? Not even 50 50 It was. And I think this has to be a pick that stays. Yeah, it definitely should be. They it should be minimum fifty fifty, right? Yeah. They said it's not going to be a DreamHack exclusive. Oh. Feels bad, man. Just wasn't working. Yeah, like, what the fuck? Uh, really nice to see a first wave. Oh wait, so that means you can buy. You don't have to go to Dreamhack yeah. to buy it. I think that's. I think that's good. That's a good. Yeah. Like this Winston, yeah, yeah, yeah. Apparently, the first round of Dreamhack Stockholm tickets are sold out too. Jesus Christ. Shit, let's go. That's insane. I want to. I want to know how many people go to uh, Dreamhack. Yeah, I don't know. That'd be. Oh. It's good to sell out. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Don't they need to live? To get back to and timers end up not losing a player on that fold back. Now they have a chance to get aggressive themselves. Oh. Falls first. This is the falls really good. Still good one. Oh, the Timeless here started to find a rhythm. It's Luminosity's pressure. And now that they've been able to kind of stop the bleeding too, like they really have the dug their heels into the sand, drawn that line, and it's up to Luminosity here to try to build up this ultimate to dislodge them. Dante has the no, Dreamhack is not in John Coping. I, I don't know what that is. Stockholm and Dallas. Just give that extra bit of pressure to sink this payload over the line. But they're starting to run out of time here a bit when it comes to just making sure they have a full slate of five. All yeah, I mean two minutes also to play with right i think that's gonna be pretty critical here sonjin again forced to use his overclock from the low ground which doesn't feel great and so he wants to play aggressively to re-establish that spot it's just too dangerous he realizes how awfully quick now his vision comes calling the disrupt the shot deployed but cj slams him with a kunai if sonjin can find one more kill here it'll be massive nice Lumino is the highest hell target and he takes the honors of removing the sojourn it's back and forth stuff here but now luminosity are without that kiriko they have a sound barrier and they hate to have to spend it here. So Luke Mino finds a very cheaply found kill with that right click. Luminosity very much still in this. Thanks to Luke. King is here with a pulse bomb, can punish right they have beat too. But the problem Which is CJ's got another rush. Across the bridge to stick it. So you With just beat late. You rush white. first or beat late. I think you rush no, they and then they beat and then you here. have to beat. Oh, okay. They just win that way. Okay. <laughs> Okay, Rocket just pulses the front line. Huge kill to open up a fight. Last time I think it was uh, Luke Mino, maybe. This time, I mean, getting a stick on the Sojourn is perfect. He finds double rush, double beat fight. And now Luminosity are down to their last 50 seconds. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Oh, but they have Primal. It's gonna have to be potentially after their high ground control. They'll have to fight to a Probably just has to Primal to live, honestly. It really would have been nice to see them get something like a... Oh, they're going early. ...to have Maybe. more ultimates to work with here, but it does come down to Vision being able to get enough space to Double use Double rush. Who uses beat first? This is how you get the oh, Dante's dead. Throw that out, force everybody to concede that position. Sonjin goes down, but they lost Dante. And they lost him far too early in this fight. Raikkanau's trying to beat. exploit the lack of a Winston on the other side by getting in Vision's face. Yeah, time to send a better beat. View, ...making it impossible to find a low health target to clean off the one shot. And, that and there is it is. Luminosity falling apart here, losing Dante a little bit too early just to a face full of damage. And Timeless able to exploit that player. Obviously, advantage, but also just a tank not being on the field. It's too hard to play around that. And Timeless even themselves up the series with a strong showing on Eichenwald. Round matchup went. Wait, again, I wonder if there's actually like a, a Hanzo shot that they can do across the map. Oh, like a Sonic or some shit? That'd be kind of cool. A little bit of a divergence from. You know, We're fucking Val boy, Valorant now with the uh, lineups. Sober. The fucking sober. <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, do you play much Valorant? Uh, you, uh, I used to play Valorant as a little variety game. I should probably get back into it. I don't know. I got tired of it after I saw like a game that had five people as like his chair, and her toilet seat, and like all this stuff. <laughs> the names are fucking crazy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there's like a, there's like a, hold on, let me see if I can find this tweet for you. The more, people say Overwatch names are unhinged, but we just have like Kitten and... Yeah, no, ours is not as bad. 
Already noted that after his time at Ike Velvet. Oh yeah, here, here, look at this, look at this tweet. These are just damage trades. A lot of the interest comes from these sojourns landing these rails. I miss him. I miss what you. You miss fuck? me. I missed and I missed her. <laughs> what the fuck? That five stack is crazy. They would have the potato thing too. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Valorant players are more unhinged. I give it another 30 seconds. You pull it up too much longer. Dante's starting to feel the pressure a little bit here. It's gonna have to disengage. You play Valorant? Mm, I'm pretty bad at Valorant, but that's not really bad. The mouse I've ever hit was like diamond. Oh yeah, I didn't even hit that. I was like, on the first act, the first season, first act or whatever it is, it's uh, I hit plat and then they adjusted the MMR and shit and now I'm like silver. <laughs> it's, a, it's a different type of vibe. It's, it's a lot slower. That's why I don't like it. Yeah, I want a ADHD kind of like brain, you know, where I'm just like, I need something to be always happening at once. And it's just, yeah, I need my brain to be active. Like Don't worry, I have a friend that spent like ten thousand dollars on Valorant skins, and they're like uh, bronze five. I'm not gonna say their name, but Megatron's in my chat right now. <laughs> oh fuck! Yeah, I mean they thought about it. They definitely thought about it. I think they realize that they don't really want the bot to get too much free progress and also don't know much about who's on that left-hand side down there. They don't want to group up too much. Sanjun here. What the fuck barrier. is that loot? What is Juby doing? Making use of the power slide in that moment, but it's still in a safe enough place, all things considered. King sees the power slide. It might be time to go here with his pulse. Maybe concerned about the Susu as well. There's a lot of layers you have to get through his tracer. Oh! Window, as well and truly close line. Vision finds one, but that's all. The Luminosity, you're gonna get there. Yeah, they should nerf Arissa though, actually. A nice tussle over the point, but Timeless is able to walk it back over. Character into their needs to be nerfed territory. a little bit more, I think. True. If they nerf Tracer, like they need Arissa quite, nerfed quite too, bro. Ultimates there for Arissa, Arissa's too much, man. It's too much survivability. Um, if Arissa especially with DPS now, passive. Really yeah. yeah. If Arissa doesn't have a, a nerf, bro, I'm gonna cry. Yeah. Everybody else got weaker and Arisa got stronger because that DPS. She like has way more survivability than everybody else. Oh my! That was. Nice shit by Vision. Vision's actually kind of clapping with, with the surge. Over the last couple of maps. Oh, okay, he's he's oh, oh, who wins? Oh, nice. so J3, so you they know I'm better than you, just bar. accept it. Hey, buddy. Oh, okay. Well, that's that's who the fuck are you? Push this bot over to that first checkpoint. Uh, but this you just followed my stream is, to try to talk shit. So for both sides. You have no ultimates oh, for it's a new account created. Fact, oh, never mind. I got it. Have to wait for another player, but Luminosity is backing up. I mean, it's still a decent place to buy because you've like, why are people so fucking uh, weird? You're better than me in a video game. Oh my god, you're so, that's so crazy. My life is ruined. CJ <laughs> riskily. <laughs> Shows his whole self out there in the open while healing out the sojourn. Okay, Katsuna Rush had to be matched here because the better DPS coming Icy's way. Well, CJ needs a little bit of help with covering that up. A great focus fire on Adante. He's down. Sonjin eventually falls, though. So now it is a sojourn advantage for Luminosity. How will J3 recover from this? Oh my god, chat. How will I recover, bro? I'm not the best player to ever touch this game. I think my career is over. They might have themselves a checkpoint available. Open to trying to take the fight in there towards oh, this Dicey, is helping out. What Great the fuck is happening? Moment to focus down on the Kiriko without cooldowns. I don't know, man, but Luminosity, so five minutes left. Yeah, it, look, so it looks like a team death match right now. It actually is, yeah. Okay, there we go. Point. Fucking hell. Uh, Nico, pretty much in seven months, and, so back and forth. Azariah, which nice pretty much in nine months is that good for seven months? Did I say right? Back up and try to get some ults online before that last engagement. Uh, but Luminosity, they still have the ultimate advantage right now. Again, Squeak gets caught out in the open on their own, and it happens a second time. Always prophetic that moment was, but I see might be the bigger fish to fry here as King's been out of secure. The yeah, there's no way Luminosity loses this when they're down they their tank. The also, God, should that be required? Has extra defensive options in terms of search, which will apply for a time. 
Yeah, I mean Dante's just gonna bridge solo, man. You, they get lead though. That's pretty good. Yeah, that's not good for Luminosity. Yeah. This is huge for Timeless. They lose their Orisa and still get to keep coming forward or at least not give ground. Now Icy's gonna be back in the fight. Surely you don't have to push more. Yeah. Just so much better for Timeless, and now that Icy is back, as you mentioned, like I think Luminosity, they they just need this mess. Appreciate the massive new tier one sub, my friend. Wait for their own fifth member to return. Definitely need to return. Dante preserve his HP there. Exactly. You see, like he's not doesn't want to play any open because he knows his healers are occupied right now, and he can't rely on them here. Pulse bomb for Rocket could be big. Dante hoping to be be full health before attempting a Terra Surge play potentially. Rocket again to the high ground. Oh, I see the pincer comes in. Sonjun slides into the face here of Vision and King. Damn. Good kills. And CJ falls a result Still of that. TDM. Gives up his life, but he gets his but it's not clean. Great response from Luminosity defenders. Can they get another kill? Oh my god, he can. He has re- Oh, he's a re- Yes, eight seconds. Yep, with a rocket pick off here, Luminosity are back But still, because the fight's not clean, you just game. can't push. It's like three or four minutes true, yeah. Two, and we're down to three minutes and 15 in the round. Yeah, it's just, it's just stand if Luminosity still, just ult time, dump on this corner, this they might now just be able to do it, but they're going to fight mid to their territory, though. They are just waiting for reinforcements so they can actually pop some of these ultimates. What a wonderful fight for them to win with using nothing. So they've got five coming into this next fight. <laughs> so you should be feeling pretty confident if you're a Luminosity fan right now that they can get the job done. Timeless is giving a fair bit of ground before the fight even Double starts. Double rush, do not die challenge. Has moved up to their side of the straightaway. Here's a terror surge. Not really targeted one there. It looked like Dante just wanted to maybe force some action out. Well, he got what he asked for. Sound barriers now from both sides, but Vision will, will be will, the one with the overclock. Once that barrier clears, Sonjun, though, very close to building his. Will he have an opportunity? Vision wants to try and chase him down. To surely, surely, surely he gets the kill. CJ might be punished for oh, oh my god, that was a little his scary. time, though. Vision now has a high ground position to play Ooh, from, and Sonjun what a flick. finally gets involved. That's two kills for the Timeless Sojourner, and he's looking for more. That's an on-ping flick, HP too. Is, is he not with and his uh, team? Down, I don't think so. I think Sonjun is still playing from Korea. I could be wrong, but... I thought he was playing from Korea. I have to check. Because he was playing first. Bro, this game is back and forth, bro. At 44 to 40... It's basically 44-44 with two minutes left. That's fucked up. Like, this is the closest push map I've ever seen. Oh, not so instead of luminosity. It's a tenuous lead, boys, but you're right. It is one of that. Yep, Icy getting picked off there. That was a hell of a lot of damage. Pumps into Icy. Oh, SL. Now, this is very, very dangerous. Yeah, I think he's in Korea. Could be wrong, but. Oh, a little bit. Okay. Let's them now play in enemy territory. Both teams have all dumped. Wow. Leverage. What a pick, though. Getting rid of the tracer is good at least. I feel like Darissa has to touch. Getting picked. But we have a 4v4. Can Sonjun actually get here? He has some ability to... I mean, they're just trying to stop the perma bridge stall when CJ dies. So that's not good for, uh... Oh, squid's dead. Okay, just TDM. This could be bad. I actually ranked TDM. Sonjun under no real threat from Dante, but the... Yeah, well, this is, a, this is a, just a team <laughs> deathmatch, man. <laughs> this is, like, ranked. <laughs> what the fuck am I watching? With only Icy and Juby in play. Oh, opener, excuse and Icy doesn't die except CJ. You want to try and force that out here if you can. Pulse, the Rishi survives a pulse. I'm actually really surprised he used pulse 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 the pulse there. Yeah, that was a bit. I think he thought he could get the kill, but the Suzu. The, the Suzu was gone. He, he thought he could get the kill because the Suzu was gone, but the Rishi starts a shit ton of armor really and getting caught in the stall that Luminosity put forth out of the bot just a couple Jesus seconds Christ. ago. Is that we are now in last fight territory. Timeless have the ultimate advantage. And it's a luminosity. They just want to try to buy as much time as they can. To get five meters, man. Five online. meters. Last fight. Look, it could be an even four v four fight. No, so holy shit, bro. Timeless has a lot of ults. So yeah. luminosity the rush that, though. though. Sun just needs to find a headshot. Oh, he got one. And they pulled him in. Oh, they got vision. What a beat. Wow, timeless is actually gonna win this. Holy. It's like they're playing shipment on COD 4. Like it's just. Like, Everybody's in each other's faces, and that should be it, yeah. Timeless. Wow. Do this. Not Holy Ooh. shit. I feel like Luminosity should have waited a little bit more to build their ults, but they kind of fucking went too early, man. Timeless, though, would prefer not to have to show something like that until we get to the main event itself. Here we go first. Flashpoint, as per usual, folks. Middle of the map. 
We're going to have a Cassidy versus Soju and difference. So uh, this is actually making the I don't switch know. here. I don't Drop them more than happy. I like the Cassidy. Pick up where Sonja left off. And we'll have the Orisa mirror. It'll be a Baptiste though for Squid. All right. So the Baptiste coming back into play. You do have the immortality field. Still think even though better. on a oh, small cooldown. Uh, but can't yeah. save the that. Fella. No, I mean, that, that, that's just a, like a very easy one-two combo that is a super effective hey, the range to chuck one, and then uh, you yeah. just throw in the railgun, and there's nothing Cassidy can really do. <laughs> chop it very quickly. Uh, not not too far. Okay, good. Back into the lineup here. It's always so interesting to see how Timeless play around the use of, of Chopper and Sonjun's... Kettle Sonjun's, corn, popcorn. What's your favorite popcorn? Very different Ooh, reasons. Probably similar, just, uh, right. you don't have it in the US, but we do this, yeah, um, Chopper is basically it's like just a sweet, sweet and salted in the UK, uh, and it's like it's slightly salty, but it's got, I, I guess it's like um, sugar syrupy kind of shit on top of it, I don't know. You can only get it in cinemas, it feels like. Or like, um, or just like normal salted popcorn. Oh, I'm pretty basic, to be honest. I mean, uh, kettle corn's like sweet, and you, you can put a little bit of salt on it. Sweet and salty, yeah. Hell yeah, that's my jam. He's struggling to keep his team healed up through that DPS passive. Eventually, he's able to get them to some more stability. It's like salted chocolate. You ever that? Oh, no, no. Chocolate with sea salt in it? Oh, bro, it goes crazy. Never had that. I don't like dark chocolate. Oh, really? No. I, I only really like dark chocolate, to be honest. I like normal chocolate. White chocolate, I'm kind of mad on, but... Uh, and that's going to be so tough hard. to get back into because you got like Rocky that's going to be pressuring down oh, with this so pulse good. bomb and CJ even why, why is chat saying fuck off to me? Right. What the hell did Tuesday I do? Dark chocolate sucks. <laughs> <laughs> I mean... <laughs> nah, chat... I'll take. Milk chocolate is the best. They use a sound barrier and still get crushed. You've had Cadbury's, right? That is not only yeah, like this proper point, English chocolate. Nice. Oh, oh, the next yeah. one. Opener is grinning from ear to ear. I have some in my fridge right now. Oh, that's the whole night. Oh, yeah, what shit. I bought a ton of that stuff back from the UK when I came back. That is bad, delicious. like Galaxy and Bar and stuff. Oh, it's so good. Immediate control. Uh, sound, sound barrier is something that could totally give you that. So as we take a look at where we're going next for Flashpoint, it's going to be Refinery, and this is actually where I would feel like... Come on, LG. You're going to need to win this, bro. Just because of how close this space really is, you got to fight close together. Yeah, well, it's pretty rough. Time is a beat. The point, you want to push into that choke and take advantage of the fact that you're a Okay, let's, let's hear it. Let's hear it. Sort of filter out. Dante, of course, has also risk the CCs, then that. hit the B. Okay, okay, there's two. Okay, so it's an aggressive sound barrier used here by Timeless. Oh, what? I'm actually really so wait. I'm actually really surprised he did that. That was such a good peel from Dante, actually. He just stood in front of them and fucking terror surge. That was sick. And I see desperately being Dante popped off, right actually. CJ, but it's slow. The healing not coming all at once. There's no burst about it. Still low. I see his defensive cooldowns again and pops the terror surge probably for that exact same reason, but there's not enough healing to remove the Lucio. All right, well, that's good news, though, for Luminosity. They got past good shit, the, LG. the behemoth, which is that sound bear that... Yeah, but you're going to have to get past the uh, Rush the Sojourn so Tracer now. One for both yeah. <laughs> Looking at another the Rush is just way better. Timer, Someone said hearing Jaws swear is so weird. Chopper, but Luminosity <laughs> you get fined if you swear. You, you don't get fined, right? This point. Just, you know, no, no, no. We just get told off. You know? oh. I, I have a... I swore in 2020 I was casting with Josh, like Sideshow. I said that's a disgusting fucking angle. And I was like, oh. <laughs> oh no. We just, get, we just get told off, but we didn't get fired. <laughs> you, you get told in your ear, right? When you're casting? Yeah. Well, no, normally they just send this an email out to us, like, in, in our text chat or whatever. They're like, yeah, probably best not to swear. And I'm like, yeah, I know. Uh, <laughs> But not after Everybody Luminosity's already so walked away with 80%. <laughs> one more fight here, and Luminosity get a chance to tie up this. And they said, haha, you remember the year. Uh, still off the back of the yeah, spot. yeah, and people won't let, let me fucking forget it. Well. This is another kind of interesting. I remember the map too, and I remember the angle too. To Havana, Widowmaker, first so point through like this small really crack the on the first corner. Really? Damn, it was not that bad. Not even close. <laughs> no one lets me forget it. None of the talent levels like get it. Maybe a bit exposed in that position, so rectifies it instantly. Fifty-eight percent and counting now. I see. Trying to stay in this fight, but the sound barrier is going to be nice. LG. Oh, okay. I will say Dante is kind of popping actually on the Risa. I remember watching Dante when he was a somber one trick, man. Yeah. Oh yeah. 
Alrighty, so all tied San Francisco shock Dante. Going on to the next flashpoint, still with ultimates to They asked you, do you have a clip of you swearing? Uh, the interesting thing about the Cassidy Probably is, somewhere. You know, yeah. Based on where you are, somewhere I guess besides by death on. <laughs> I actually be really nice to have as a zoning ultimate. What better than to have Bob and Bayer or Pitch Master Summon Munch? Territory to play around to have that Cassidy pop off. Alrighty. Vision here. This map can play to his ideal sidelines at times, but honestly, Tropic and space enough that the damage fall off of Vision becomes pretty significant. Not if you're hitting headshots though. He's still gonna have impact. Oh, oh my God. wow. He was, he was like, like nope. I think Vision was maybe expecting a javelin. I'm not sure. Either way, you put the plug on that. Shot on top Ooh, of him. Uh, that'll do it. Nah, just take the damage, bro. What's the worst that could happen? <laughs> he gets chunked. You only need oh, one God. HP. A sad flashback moment to Coliseo. I mean, again, like he he didn't he wasn't really able to do much with that dead eye. I think that the timeless were really going to offer him much of an opportunity to turn that into a kill. So I appreciate the discipline at the very least. And hey, you get a free reload. Don't forget, there's always some upside <laughs> with your dead eye. But now we have two Terra Surges in play. It's that sound barrier advantage, though, that Opener has. That we've actually seen manifest on that first flashpoint as well. Okay. That's going to be enough. Yeah, just okay, okay. pushing the luminosity. So these two teams are out of sync, Rose, on those sound barriers. Oh, oh my god, he actually killed, killed him. He almost ran into his teammate, too. Yeah, that's kind of what we were hoping to keep paying attention to, right? Is that. Okay, Rocket wins this. And they're stalling for time, too. This is super good for. Rocket is immortal on this point. Holy shit, please. Someone shoot CJ. CJ, there you go. At particular advantage. No, it didn't work. He was like 3 HP, but. Both times that Openers had it. They got like an extra 25% off that shit. Shit, that was sick. Yo, Amy's pretty much of a thousand bits as well, so my friend. Madison! To a prolonged engagement, probably, you know, to some degree, owing to the sound barrier having been used there. But I have notifications turned off, chat, for the tournament, sorry. ...to take 30, 40, 50 percentage uh, off this combination of support ultimates now at their fingertips. I see though at least has Terra Surge, but that's really speculative. It's gonna be hard to get value when your opponents are so, so durable. Under Squid's waiting for him to speed onto him with the Terra Surge. Oh, it's yeah, Ames? Oh, so my, my, my bad. How's that Ames? It looks like a mess. My bad. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm probably gonna forget about that. I'm probably, I'm probably gonna fuck up and call you a mess again. And they have rushed too. And they let Icy die like that. God damn. Ooh. Oh, what a stick. Oh my god. Any, any was ulting. Holy fuck. Oh! Right. Damn, Vision. Dude, Vision and Dante. God damn. Let's go. Okay. My name is Amy, Maybe but people call me a mess. I'm gonna call, I'm gonna be honest with you. I think I can remember. I can remember Amy. There's plenty for Vision to be able to get that one. Maybe Luminosity doubt is in shambles. To seal the deal on that second flashpoint for Luminosity. Now we're gonna head over to the scrapyard. Oh, there you go. There's two Amy's. Nope, your name is gonna be Ames. Have these Cassidy's and these Sojourns just take these sight lines. But once again, we have the conundrum of. Opener is going to have a sound barrier, but is it going to be enough of a difference maker in this fight for Timeless to, to keep control of the flashpoint or even get it? Yeah, I mean, they have to turn it into something. Look, they can't be using it defensively. They need to lean into it proactively. Open, I mean, getting chunked down. The poke damage is really yeah, They know he has Terra Surge to too. Half of his original HP. Oh, he's so rocket. Who's he trying to catch? Ah, oh, they've all tracked the Lucy. They didn't even force the beat out of him. Yeah, I mean, that was a good Suzu from CJ to keep opener up. And able to save Opener's life, who then pays the favor with a fantastic fight sound barrier that will give Timeless the flashback. The GG's B, which kind of sucks, but. All right, third time's the charm sometimes. You can kite away from the uh, window. Get the job done, the rock, really. and major you know, credit to Opener for just the, the perfect timing of that ultimate. And now Timeless. I like that, Rai Rai. That, get a chance to work up to get another of that kind of nice rotation we expect to see. CJ with the Kitsune Rush is a nice engagement tool for this next one. Rocket with another Pulse Bomb. Rocket has been farming these left and right. Yeah, and also getting value out of them as well. There was a, oh, okay. Rocket got spared. Yeah, for killed. a time, their like be in trouble, but it's actually Rocket that gets Isn't that awesome? I love Arissa. To punch I love Arissa. I love getting stunned. I love she doesn't with die. Four here. They cool. also don't want to feed over. Another terror surge potentially from the much of luminosity are coming up on these big ultimates. They are heavily favored coming into this next fight. 
especially with the sound barrier. That, that's really the, the big key is Juby has just been so clean with the timing and making sure that everybody's finding maximum value. Uh, okay, pay them so to point, hit the rush. Around, but for how long does Luminosity Very start to make their approach? Okay, time to go for Katuna Rush. What can they turn this into? Rocket's forced to play defensive for the time oh being. Oh, my God, Oh, poor Rocket, bro. Dante again. And Matrix there at the back of the point. Holy shit. Squid didn't benefit from the sound barrier, but handing over an offensive... Ooh. Oh! It's going to become something, but I see... I see fucking Gary. Three off the terror surge. What a way to a timeless back in this game. What the fuck? That looks... That... that that should have been GG right there, bro. That should, yeah, that should have been game. As soon as Dante gets the kill on Rocket, that should have been game. Oh my god. That is nuts. One more fight, though. That's what I like about Overwatch 2, though. In Overwatch 1, I feel like if you get a kill, you can still, like, win. In Overwatch, or lose. Like, you lose the fight, and it's 6v5. But here, if you lose one, you can win the fight before. Yeah, it's very possible, yeah. Everything has more impact in lower, uh, like, Five. Vision here, trying to square up on ice. Holy high noon. Bro is like uh, kissing them with this high noon. Oh my god, he kills Chopper. And you okay, still get a kill. Oh my god. They do trade, but this terror surge is fucking huge. And opener got uh, hindernated too. So he died. He insta died in terror surge. Nah, you have to kill Rocket, bro. You have to kill Rocket. He doesn't saw another 25%. He's got no re. That's it. Loot. Map 5. Matt, bye, bro. Holy shit, dude! Dante and Vision just went freakish. It's gonna be, it's gonna come down to the wire here. I think Shambali Monastery is one of those maps that you don't always know how it's gonna end until it's over, and it all comes down to this very first point. Can the attacking team get past this first? I'm actually really surprised the team didn't full hold. I mean, uh, on hold. With access to the high ground, off the yeah, I'm. Can't really blame him too much. I think. If you're the team, if you're the team that thinks they're like straight better, and if you're in, I don't know, if you think you're like super good, like compared to them, I think try and spawn hold, but if you just want to like a really long first fight, you just hold here. Especially with the back as well, I think it's actually better for you. If you play the Kiri, it's probably better if you just spawn hold, because you you have a lot more mobility, but with the back, you just get run over. But if you hold the high ground with the back, it's way better. Because as well, you can get window, you can play on height, and then you just window them. You're hoping for a long fight with the bat so you get the window first take it yeah i mean I he almost sense. does yeah he almost does have but they almost have rush as well yo yeah, amy that's, uh, with the massive five gifted get get absolutely insane i appreciate him so it makes sense because then, then yeah then you just win it from high ground you guarantee win this fight because they can't perch rather than like that just getting run over when they when they go as well. No kills Damn, Amy with the massive really W. Lockstep play for They're waiting for the rush to. I think when they rush, we're gonna win though. Yeah, there you go. Oh. That's rough. I mean, it's a solid hold in two minutes. Yeah, you take that. You take that. And they use their rush, which is very worth the trade. Rush is way better than window. Four ults against four ults. Who do you think wins? What's great for uh, both of these teams is that look how inexpensive be, it was for better Timeless. Be I, only a Katsune rush there to break through that defensive stronghold. But Luminosity uh, earless still manager to appreciate us in six months as well. The amplification matrix. So uh, I think we still have some more shenanigans to get up here too, Mitch. Absolutely, we are at the tip of the iceberg right now in terms of chaos. Hey, you tell me the overclock here for good shit by Dante, and he didn't get he didn't get beat. He's trying to power slide away from the terror surge. Dante is looking a clue. No immortality field available to keep Luminous. Uh oh, gets fucking rolled because he went behind the wall. Dante and Vision. So despite losing a player first in this fight, Timeless get a huge win, taking a fight off yeah. the beaten track, so Oh, speak. that's rough. And Squid can't do anything to stop he this. Heals. Timeless win two straight fights. Now oh, they've used so many ultimates too on both sides. Uh, as we've kind of seen time and time again now, the high dude's not really going to be much more than a zoning ultimate here. And even though you have access to this window, the disruptor shot from Chopper can push you back. And now Luminosity have no choice except to try to fight on this high ground, as we still see a bit of card progress being made here by Rocket. Yeah, I mean we sort of find value randomly on like the the junkyard of last map, where you like I think 
Vision randomly kills uh, Rocket reload. with it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it was, but yeah, that's right. The reload was valued, but there was a Tracy kill that was pretty impactful. But you Easiest can't, rush of his life said, there. On that at all. Rack a little bit low. Dead There's no Vision way ready. Vision comes out of this alive. I was just about to say, if you pull that... Yeah, I was going to say, there's no shot. He fucking steps so far up. That was so risky to pop my noon there. Okay, timeless. They don't want to lose, man. It's so tough because when you're the Baptiste of the situation, what do you use the Ant Matrix for? Is it going to be selfish just for you? Do you try to set it up for your team? Either just way, it feels like you're making yourself like... Uh, like vulnerable though, right? Because now you're giving yourself this big shiny box that you're like, oh, as timeless, we know somebody's gonna pe peek their head out through there. That's right, yes, yeah, it's basically click here for free kill. <laughs> At least it seemed like that in the first it's fight. On sign. Yeah, it's like one of those bad like scam ads you'd see on like, you know, early <laughs> 2000s Geo Cities and, and forums, right? You just wouldn't, you wouldn't dare. Timeless here. Have that Terra Surge up. But it's a sound barrier I'm looking at. Juby's about to build his in concert with Opener. So pretty even footing to take this next fight on. Vision goes down before there's any chance to oh. use that sound barrier. Oh, oh man. No, nah, Opener can't even beat there because he just dies. All good though. Rocket is alive, so they win. It's already over after they lose yeah, man. That, I feel bad for oh, LG, man. It's just getting kind of fucked on, actually. And then Thomas have Rush. Yeah, I don't know. Their only good hold was the first one, man. The carry is just so much better than the BAP. Irrepressible. <laughs> the game over rough. spray. Oh no, don't do it to him. Faster immortality, faster. Or something. I'm not sure. It looks like he's uh, getting his ult faster right, too. When is the sound barrier going to get used? Oh yeah, stop easily. What? Because in the past we've seen Juby use this as a response to the Kitsune rush from CJ. But when Opener also has one, it just feels like it's going to be such a non-factor. What's well, this huge disadvantage? And Squid here, this is not the best place to use Ant Matrix, I would suggest. You'd have to play it down. Holy shit, they forced Lapa already. I'd rather have some high ground to deploy it from. Okay. So gotta give it a little bit of extra ground that's first. Not so good. that's already an immortality field down. And that's before Timeless have really done anything more than just posture menacingly at the defenders. Juby in this speed. Has to be a match. Come on, LG, you're gonna have to win at least one fight here, man. He's gonna be chopping with the overclock and he respects that Ant Matrix. Yeah, they. Peering around. He's window for the overclock, so he can't get any value. But... But and now they just walk in with Rush. Oh, what a pulse by King! Fine kills to hit the reset. Yeah, reset. And now Luminos, he finally mm -hmm. finds a stop. Mm -hmm. Finally, get timeless to respect them on this map. Oh, but it has the damage already been done. You have such a small amount of distance left to be able to make that. Or they can make it work. If you're timeless, and you oh shit! Wait, timeless does have four ults, but LG has, has yet to hit the sound three. Barrier, by the way, uh, so still has at least been able to hold on to it for a more critical just moment, me. where you are looking at timeless with just almost a critical mass. I mean, ultimates. I'm pretty sure if they pop all their so ults here, they could just cap. have to keep this card stopped. Right, close, maybe not. Right, low, go. very low. So he has to give up all that space that he but just Didn't he just throw in the post bomb here? Maybe try and bait out the window? Oh, okay. Oh, wait! Are you serious? What a fucking stick, though. Jesus what Christ. What He wasn't even looking at him. Bro just said, get down, Mr. President. I'll take the stick for you. I mean, at least they forced Pulse and Rush two more ults last fight. And they, oh shit, they have, if they lose this fight with five bolts, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fly to Cali so I could cry in your fucking arms, bro. You heard people talking about Scott being, you know, like a, it might, hey, it might happen. You know, pretty, pretty flexible player, able to do it all. Don't say that, man. Like about to go crazy. That's an expensive trip. Oh, okay, Rocket's there. Okay, okay, they don't need ults. They push, push the spawn, push, push. Yeah. Huge push. They need this to come so out they need to get their kills. Yeah, that's it. That's, that's, yeah, okay. Yeah, 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 touch spawn doors. Nice. Nice Holy shit, they used all play. five ults for that. Oh, the Tracer, the Tracer! The Tracer touched though! Oh my god, wait, she died in a weird way.
If those last few fights don't go so disastrously for the attackers, they're gonna have to What a fucking hold. Holy shit. But yeah, that was a good was... hold. But really can LG like can LG push it? Which a couple of fights ago that they could have just completed the map. But I think if you're luminosity now, you got to take a deep sigh of relief. You did not let Timeless have all three points. You now get a chance to show up here on the attacking push, but it all comes down to can you get past that first point? Because we've already seen today, teams get full health on that point. It's what so do you think, man? I need so I need the Jaws <laughs> fortune. So, uh, what is it? They, they just gotta, I they, mean, gotta put up it's winnable, but Shambali Monastery fucking that. sucks it's, with tax. Yeah, so I don't know. The first checkpoint, that's great, but timeless... I don't know. I still... Like, the thing is, I still think the Kiri is just better than the Bat. Yeah, true. And it's just so much... Like, you can kite Window super easy. And if you just, like... If you just force them to use Window and then run in with Rush B, like, you just can't lose that. Because you rush, and then they have to try and beat or try and kite. If they can't kite, they'll beat. And then you just beat later, and it's just... Like it's a very, very long know. map, and I've had now often these first point holds are, it's, it's, so it's second, rough, even. it's rough. So it holds towards the end I just of the map think... as well. Mm -hmm. It's just genuinely very difficult. If Vision and Dante go fucking psycho like again, then fair enough. Like, for a lot actually, of the map, I think Vision was so sick before role, uh, in the last few maps on the cast. The climb tends to be. Yeah, see you and Dante's I positioning on the wrist was super good too. I'm not going to go with but I kind of wish they did against a slower comp. There's too much risk against Chopper. What? Might. We're enemies, uh, man. <laughs> might. And, and I wouldn't. I wouldn't. Holy. This. I really. Okay. There we go. Okay, there you, go. Uh, you know, listen. A little right click out the gate. Give, I was Love give to it see that. Because I think if you do put all of your eggs into the Zenyatta basket, you are ex expecting to explode somebody. You put that orb of discord, and they should be deleted from the server. Uh, maybe just going with a. Okay, so King and Rocket. Okay, and Rocket just needs to check his ass. Brought, but maybe they were just in anticipation of I don't know, that matchup against Rocket yeah, is always scary. Yeah, Rocket's already backing up as well. It's yeah, smart for him, doesn't want to go down, like, every sure, repaired but, already. Uh, yeah, the, the value proposition is Yeesh, exactly sure. okay, Rocket is taking infinite is nice damage. So I like this great pressure on Riker. They've not really bothered about the high ground too much, right? They're oh my god, they actually oh. raced and killed Dante. On dealing with the tanks, but it's taken well, tanks are down. To get rid of Riker. So much so that Dante yeah, goes down here, first. Though. King has much shit. That may not be what ends this fight. It's got Rian three though, if you can stay alive. They need to be able to try and complete some of these Spawns kills. Good. And they are no closer to getting the high ground. Holy with fuck. Rocket contesting the He's on that harpoon. Sure <laughs> yeah, what the <laughs> fuck? He like read that as well. And gets killed instantly. Well, that's one way that yeah, you that's can a decent amount of pushing that's a faster uh faster push than timeless did is sight, is just yeah and this is like one of the points too where you can use no window like super effectively it's like hard to oh, run away from the window on this corner the oh, yeah, i'm actually really surprised they're not taking space luminosity are playing around this archway which is a great defense so they want an off angle yeah this is super smart from squared actually we saw a fight taken here earlier on. I you just get right get the penalty around the corner hit the window as soon as the arista tries to touch and just shoot the arista when she does no one can no one can deal with this shit. Rocket needs to go like the yeah. There's the window. Oh, yeah, he's probably gonna stick. He that. does! Oh, he got the matrix. Okay. Immortality smile. Oh, and the beat. And open it. Open it was 3% away from beat and died. Fuck. No, 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 not fun. Good. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. True, 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 true. true. Dude. Holy. Rocket's still shit. alive. They're doing it. They're doing it. They're actually doing it. Holy shit. Come on, LG. Come on, They're doing LG. It. This is a great and they waste start. rush too. Opener needed that beat. I, the opener has that beat. That's way different. I'm not cheering just because LG's my org, but Timeless beat me in in the Swiss, so I want I want Timeless to lose. It's, it's my I'm living through LG. This is my revenge. And so you'll see Dante immediately try to take a bit more of that forward space and get a bit of pull. How's how's that fucked, Meg? That's fine. Next to him, but back up. Great no, LG's not my org. It's the, it's the org that I stream for for the, for the past like two years, Jack. Oh, the Magnate onto Rocket. Rocket just needs to die here. Oh, he's still alive. Okay, nice. Come on. They're doing it, man. They're fucking Hell doing it. Yeah, bro, I'm about to clap without my hands, man. Holy. And with just like four so players Three players, Yo, in fact, Luminosity has not been stopped. <laughs> Three and a half minutes to work with. Everything according to plan for the underdog team in this matchup. Ooh, well, Luminosity 
Might not be able to sink this over the line right now. As though, as I say that, the Juvie taxi has arrived. Okay, this rush actually has to go Zesky insane, please. Five here, uh, with oh, good lamp. Very, very little. Not sure I think the windows are actually really good. At, the windows, like, yeah, like for this, for a moment like this. Put your window down, and if they go to cart, you basically shred them. Yeah, Squid and Pigeon holding off angles like that was so nice. Holy shit, they're doing it. They're actually straight doing it. I've actually never heard of Squid. I don't, maybe I'm just stupid and I don't remember, but like... He's cooking. around for a little while. Holy shit, four minutes! Four minutes for 56 meters! Well, 55 and a half, but 56. First real challenge on the way to proving that here in stage two. And they might be about to do it. They've got a whole four minutes to make this happen. That should be plenty of time. Like, like, if they all track in here as well, they know open it doesn't have feet, but it's hard to tell in a lot of these weird fights, but I'm assuming they kind of know he's not close. Because they can just beat rush with King's pulse as well. They just beat rush, King goes in like super aggro, hits a pulse. Or like tries to get a pulse. They beat him. Good beat. Ah, oh, okay, Mag, thank you. Yep, that's it, that's game. Oh! The high news. Rocket 1v3, no re. Oh. Yo, with three Yo. minutes to spare! Yo, my chat just got poor! 3.1 million! Okay, friends, YouTube thinks you might like this next video, so let me know if they're right.